This morning, billions of dollars is headed to the Mid-South to help improve infrastructure that you use every day. Today actually kicks off Infrastructure Week. And just a, over an hour ago, the Biden administration unveiled plans for the Mid-South. Stephen Reels is joining us in studio to break it all down. Stephen, good morning. Good morning, Yvonne. And we are talking about billions of dollars being used on projects like what you see behind me. Money is being used on roads, bridges, even expanding access to high-speed internet. Now, the tri-state area has received more than $51 billion in public and private funds to improve infrastructure, according to the Biden-Harris administration. Tennessee got the most with $27 billion. Big projects here include investments into sections of I-40 and a new $54 million operations and maintenance facility for MATA. And railroad rehabilitation, also another one of those big projects. But one of the bigger pushes in the country's infrastructure has actually been cutting health care costs, according to the Biden administration. They said nearly 3 million seniors and people on Medicare in the Mid-South will be saving money on their prescription drug costs, and that includes insulin. Yvonne? 